Hey everybody, Ed from Ed's Attention to Detail. Got a couple of projects going on. I'm sure y'all know about a, a couple of them. Well, pretty much all of them. Anyway, build the buffalo. So I wanted to show you an update on that. I uh, got a little bit done on the hoof and uh, I tried to do the spray foam. You'll remember that from the previous video. Well, when I tried to use the spray foam, the nozzle broke off the can. So I got to get another can of spray foam. But anyway, I'm still going to give that one a shot and see if that works. I'm going to show you an update on the Bumblebee Camaro Transformers build that I'm doing. And uh, you can kind of see that one back here in the, in the background. Got some paint on it. Uh, still not real happy with it, but I'm going to go with it. And I'm going to show you the progress on my 148 scale Corsair sitting right here behind me as well. Again, got some paint on it. Not real happy with it, but I'm going to go with it. So let's take a look at these things and uh, bring everybody up to speed. Okay, so as you can see, I've been working on the hoof of uh, Build the Buffalo. I want to call him Buffalo Bob, but uh, I'm not sure about that. I'll let Ernie uh, actually come up with a name. But the hoof is coming along. So what I think I'm going to do from here is I got some more sanding to do. Um, I've basically been sanding and filing on it, uh, kind of getting the basic shape here. Uh, I'm going to drill a hole into the bottom of, of the, the leg there and into the hoof. And I'm going to put a pin in there to hold those together. And then I'm going to try and fill this little void right here in the front. But coming together, looking pretty good. Like I said, haven't done anything with this big hole up here in the shoulder yet, but uh, we'll get to that one. Okay, so the Bumblebee Transformer Camaro. As you can see, I got a, a coat of paint on it here. Make sure my computer don't go to sleep. I'm trying to save another video right now. But I uh, got a coat of paint on it, and everything's looking pretty decent. Uh, now I've got a little bit of problem right here across the, the hood uh, where, where the paint just kind of looks rough. Uh, now I am going to do the black rally stripes like the uh, Transformer car had in the movie. So I'm thinking that the majority of that's going to get covered up. So I'm not going to worry about it too much. I've already had this one in the, uh, the super clean bath um, once, maybe even twice, I don't remember. But I know at least once it's been in the super clean bath. And I'm just tired of going through that process. So I'm going to go with what I got and uh, we'll see how it turns out. Now. 148 scale Corsair got the paint on it and as you can see uh, it looks decent but the paint is not very smooth I got the bottom of it sprayed and you can see that that looks really nice okay so I sprayed that one night and I let it dry and I was gonna come back and spray the top the next day and for some reason the nozzle on the spray can started messing up and it was just spitting paint and so I think that's where I got that rough texture from um, I actually switched paints in the middle of all of this and went with a different color blue on top than I got on the bottom that's just because I had a second can of paint so the Corsair uh, it is what it is can't duck this one in super clean because I got the fuselage put together I would never get that out of there uh, so if you look real close right here around the canopy, I've got a, a, a really high edge right there. I'm going to have to file that down and try and smooth that out. This canopy just did not fit on this, uh, this model very well at all. Uh, I did some filing up here in the front. It's not perfect, but it's, I'm going to kind of live with that one. And then I got to go around and I still got to paint around the edges. Uh, kind of hide that uh, that glue mark there I don't know what this green is right here um, I have to see if I can get that out but anyway of course there is not going to be perfect uh, and, and I hate that because that's uh, what I strive for on, on all my builds but like I said before it is what it is so those are my three projects right now that I've got going on uh, well that aside from work family, uh, packing up, getting ready to move, and uh, YouTube creating. So, staying busy guys. I uh, hope you enjoy the update, and remember, we'll see you again real soon. 
Pay attention to the details. Later. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and go ahead and hit the notification button so you know when I'm doing a new video. Like this video and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Also, feel free to share this with any of your social media sites.